All right. So as you can see, my trailer is being used for something that is one designed for. Well, it is designed, I guess, to haul stuff like that. But the problem is, I'm not planning on hauling that anywhere. Uh, just and had no place. To 16 feet long to store this stuff on. I actually had to throw it all off last Saturday onto the ground. Well, about half of that or a third and go get my tractor. But my tractor's back home now for a while. And I d did a video of sawing one of these big logs. It's on my other camera. I just haven't had time to edit it and download it. It's a lot easier with my phone because I can just download it straight from my phone. But I've got a total, I think, of 52 logs cut already for the cabin. These are all 16 footers. I've got some two by tens in there with them. I think there's four, and then there's three two by eights, and two, four, six, seven, eight two by sixes. Nine. So, but that's part of it. What's been keeping me busy when I felt like it. So, and then there's the pile of logs that they all came out of. They was on the bottom side of that stump right there. I still got another one over on the mill. I got this one here that was standing dead, which you can see the wormholes in it. So I'm, I'm hoping I can get something out of it. I hate to waste. And then there's still that big one. That is a heck of a log. So I can't remember how big that thing was. And about 28 inches. Somewhere in there, 29, 30. So. And then I do have a couple other long ones laying there. They're smaller logs. I might be able to get some lumber out of this one here. It's got a bunch of limbs, so it'll have a bunch of knots in it. So we'll see. And my big pile is getting smaller. So I've gobbled up a little bit over half of it. I haven't touched this one yet, nor the one behind it. This was the last load I brought home. So that's some nice logs there. So, and then there's probably a couple more I need to just get rid of. And then some more over here. One with that dog leg in there. I don't know what I was thinking. Or if I was thinking. And then here's two 12 foot ones. These two logs here are designated for floor joists. So, and I might have a third one back there, depending on how many I'm gonna need. That one there has got a bunch of big limbs that was coming off of it. But, just walk lightly, I guess. So I don't fall through the floor. And one thing I've been doing is stripping the bark off of these things. I just ordered uh, 15 new blades, 10 degrees. I gotta cut this one to length. This is 16.4 from down there. So it's almost two feet extra sticking out there. So I'll save that little stump there and maybe do something with it. I gotta finish cutting these slabs off the last log. Like I said, I'm up to 52 logs now for the cabin. So, so this trailer actually looks a little different now. Got a bunch of logs that are sitting across the trailer. They're like eight foot logs, I think, is what they was. So I got some of them out there. Those are four. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 on the bottom there. With some 
four quarter lumber and some two, eight quarter lumber. Some pretty logs. So, there's the evidence I haven't been lollygagging. It's two rows of 12. And then I got four over there on the top side. A couple of oddball I just went ahead and cut out. I moved my walnut over here. And then this is Uncle Joe's hay wagon. He said I could use. So there's a stack of four quarter lumber on there and then some eight quarter and then a big slab right up there on top and other slabs on the uh, end of that other trailer down there I'll use them in the cabin for something they turned out really really nice so I've got everything from three inch boards all the way up to ten inch boards in this stack anywhere from eight to ten feet long so I haven't been sitting around too much for about a week and a half I was really didn't feel like doing too much so and I figured I'd do a quick update prove to everybody that I haven't been lollygagging so, working on cleaning up around the mill a little bit making it look a little better instead of stepping over a bunch of stuff all the time so got rid of all the old logs that was piled up down there all crooked things and stuff that's where the smoke's coming from from yesterday evening you know some th hardwood there i need to take down to the pile i just want to do a quick update and hopefully before too long i'll get started on that other video and uh edit it and get it put together and get it downloaded so as I get back to the house this evening, I'll download this one. So thanks for watching. Give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment. I like hearing from all of you. And I appreciate the ones that subscribe to my channel so much. And I've subscribed to a lot of channels that subscribe to me. And there's some really intelligent people out there. And I appreciate every one of them. I'm learning a lot from every single one of them. So I hope y'all have a blessed day and we'll talk to y'all later.